three binary numbers 11001, 1001 and 111001 correspond to the two's complement representation of which one of the following sets of number. So we have two's complement representation for three decimal numbers and we have to find the three decimal numbers. So let's see how we can solve it. The three two's complement representations are 1, 1, 0, 0, 1. The second representation is 1, 0, 0, 1. And the third representation is 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1. So these are the three two's complement representation. And if we compare them, we can see that 1, 0, 0, 1 is common. And in case of two's complement representation, a number is negative, a number is negative if MSB, the most significant bit, is equal to 1. Or we can say that sine bit, sine bit is equal to 1. And in all the three cases, we have MSB equal to 1. So we can say that the decimal numbers are negative. So option number A is incorrect and we are left with option number B, C and D. And we can also see that, we can also see that 1001 is common and we have a repeated MSB. Here 1 is repeated. In this case, 1 is repeated 2 times. So MSB is repeated and if we repeat MSB or sign bit in case of 2's complement representation, the number does not change. For example, if there is a number plus 3 and uh, we represent it like this 0 1 1 and uh, minus 3 is represented like this 1 0 0 this is the ones complement then we add 1 to it this will give us 1 0 1 now the MSB is equal to 1 and this is equal to 1 1 0 1 we have one repeated MSB and if I again repeat it, it means 11101. Then again, it will equal to minus 3. So all these three representations represent minus 3. This will give us the magnitude. And if we repeat the MSB or sign bit, the number is not going to change. So we can say that all these three representations are for same decimal number. They represent same decimal number. And we can say that option number D is also incorrect. And the decimal number is negative because MSB is equal to 1. Now we will find out the magnitude and uh, we will take 2's complement of 1001. There are two ways to solve this problem. In uh, first method, you have to take 2's complement of each and every representation given here. And uh, this will give us magnitude and we already know it is a negative number. So we have the negative and then the magnitude we obtained after taking the two's complement. But I'm not going to follow this method because I have already explained why they represent the same decimal number. So we will just take the two's complement of 1001. And for this, first we have to find out one's complement, one's complement of 1001. And this is equal to 0110. We have to complement all the four bits and then we will add 1 and the result is 0 1 1 1 and this is this is the 2's complement of 1 0 0 1 and this is what we need to calculate and this is in binary and it is equal to 7 in decimal and as I have already told you the number is negative so we have we have minus 7 as the answer so all these three, all these three represents minus seven. So the option number B is incorrect and option number C is the correct option for this first problem. So this is how you have to approach. Instead of solving for all the three representations, I have just used the property of two's complement representation and you can see this will save a lot of time. So go for this method. Don't waste your time finding out two's complement for all the three representations. Now we will move to problem number 2. Decimal 43 in hexadecimal and binary coded decimal number system is respectively. So we have to, we have to convert 43 in decimal to hexadecimal and 43 in decimal to binary coded decimal. So this is what we have to do in this problem and I will convert 43 to binary coded decimal. It is very easy. 
first we will convert 4 and 4 is equal to 0 1 0 0 this is how we represent 4 in binary coded decimal and 3 is equal to 0 0 1 1 so this is the representation in binary coded decimal and if we see the options we will find in option A we have 0 1 0 0 0 0 1 1 so we have correct BCD representation in option A in option B also we have correct BCD representation in option C we have 0 0 1 1 which is 3 and 0 1 0 0 is 4 34 this represents 34 so option number C is incorrect and in last option 0 1 0 0 represents 4 0 1 0 0 represents 4 so this is the BCD representation of 44 which is not correct so we are left with option A and option B and I will not find out the hexadecimal equivalent of the decimal number 43 this is homework for you this is homework for you once you have the correct option post it in comment section this is all for this lecture see you in the next one